hey, uh, to give the BOGO, buy one, get one, or buy, buy two, get two, or buy three, get three, um, or any, you know, variation of buy X, get Y. There are two ways to do this uh, in our app, actually three ways, but if you also want to give free shipping on the order, uh, there's only two ways. The first way is using the yellow badge upsell gift, give a product, and the second way is to use a smart deal. I'll cover first the first way, of course. So you can click here how to set up a buy one, get one. You can actually um, do it buy two, get two. So for example, you would select um, two items, let's say this one and this one. And uh, you would allow two units. So two, you would allow people to buy the, both of them. But you can, you know, you know, you can have a, a longer list, of course. And you will tick the box here to give free shipping. When the gifts are selected on the whole order, not only the free shipping will not only be on the gift, it will be on the whole order. Then you can add uh, a title, description, some other stuff like how is it displayed, is it a list, is it pre-selected or not, is it a slider, etc. Then you can define when it should be displayed, so the triggering condition. So in my case, for example, I would like to have a number of items and I would love to have at least two. I could also select a specific collection. So for example, if the buy to get two is specific to a collection, then I would go, for example, to the collection called all or deal or collection X. Not sure if there are actual products in my store that have collection X. Okay, I do. Um, and then that's pretty much it. So I'll call it, for example, buy to get to. And this first way, um, I will put it here, discount. So this doesn't matter, it's just a group where it's displayed, but I have so many groups and then I'll put it active. So this, <clears throat> okay, I think I, I didn't put it in the right group because I wanted to add it, uh, okay, anyway. So my point is with this way, the products that are the two that I selected to be 50% off, or 100% off will be displayed to the users in in a pop up. So I'll put it a higher prior priority because I would like. And I will also move this up. You probably don't have as many groups as I have, but I want to make sure that this is the first group that my app is checking. And um, being at the top. It means that the app script will check this group first, and this rule first, and this rule second, and third, and so on, until the bottom. So now I have this. So I will show you how it looks, and uh, then you can compare with the, using the smart deal, the second way, um, how, how it looks. It might take some time to propagate, meaning that it might take some time that you can see in the live store what you've done in the admin app but uh, i will uh, just add these two products and then you as you can see um well this one was actually a free product so that's why it's free but uh, anyway so um you can see that the bogo buy to get to will be displayed within a selection of product that was manually made by me the shipping is free. You could actually add another discount that will overwrite uh, the actual one. It will not add on top of it, and but soon enough it will. And this is something we're working on. But for now, this is the first way to do it. And if I check out, I have these products already ticked, and um, they will be a checkout added to cart with the free shipping. And this one was already free, so that's why it's a bit confusing. But this one is 50% off, and it just should also be 50% off. But uh, in my store, it was a free product anyway. 
Then I'll show you um, the second way to do the smart, uh, to do it with the smart deal. So I'll have more here. I'll select a smart deal. And then they will ask me to select a smart deal. So uh, if I go there, I'll need to create a smart deal. I'll create a new deal. I'll select BOGO, discount pair. And what is nice with this is that I could actually make it store wide. So any pair of two identical products will be, for example, 50% off. But also, I could also consider pairs of different products, which we call mix and match. Maybe a little typo here, it should be mix and match. But anyway, doing so, so it will be a store wide BOGO or specific to a collection. But if you have two items in cart, no matter you know if it's the same or not, the second one will be discounted 50%. If you have four items in cart, two of them will be discounted 50%. If you have six items in cart, three items will be discounted 50%, and so on. So if you take there. And you could also discount the most expensive product instead of the cheapest, because by default, if you take this box to consider mix and match, we will, if you have four items, we will discount the two cheapest one. Then you can also select a collection. I'll select another collection. So, yeah, I only have one product in there. I select this one then. Okay, this one has some products. And uh, I would consider mix and match. Mm. Then you can skip all of this except giving free shipping for any order or only if some products are present in the cart or if some products are uh, not present or absent from the cart. Then I will create the deal. And yes, I would like to automate it. So I choose when to apply it. And I would like to apply it if I have, for example, two items in cart. And I could also restrict it to a specific collection. So I'll call it uh, buy to get to smart deal. And I don't want to put it in the Oh, I think I still made a mistake. Okay, so I'll create the same. I have made a mistake because I have too many groups, but uh, it's not a big deal. Okay. Turn it on and I'll turn it off. Then I'll show you how it looks. I will add two products to cart. Oh no, this one is already free. So I'll try to find products that are not free. I think they all are. Oh, not this one. So I'll actually add this one twice. Okay, so there's another discount. Okay, so yeah. So one of them is discounted 50% off. And the shipping is free, like indicated there. You could also indicate it in the, you know, here. Ah, that the shipping is free. So if I go back and I try to find another product that is not free, like this one. And this could be stopped as well. 
just because I'm incognito, so it doesn't recognize. And um, so here I have three products. If I have four products, one of them is 50% off, and one of them is 50% off. So these are the bio I had to get yet two. And if I check out, I will get exactly five a seven fifty dollar off with free shipping. So this basically is the two ways or the two ways to make uh the buy one get one or buy two get two.